happy Saturday. <sighs> yeah, I missed yesterday because I'm awesome. That's that's my story and I'm sticking to it. So um, in two days, two, Tana Fenske and I are launching a love struck imprint for Entangled and I'm just like, yeah, I'm pumped. I'm so excited. I'm so excited for everybody to meet Kane who's sex on a stick and Addison who's just shenanigans good times and uh, I'm equally excited to read Tana's book because I love freaking marine for hire and to get you know get some more I'm in for it so but I've been fielding these questions on like Katie WTF is love struck well I'm gonna tell you um it's obviously a new imprint for Entangled, so we are, I am once again part of a launch of a new imprint, which is, you know, no pressure. The upside is that this is probably one of my best books to date. So if you like my stuff, you should definitely check it out because it's, it's, I'm pretty damn proud of it, if I do say so myself. Um, Love Struck is kind of like, it focuses on like the meat cute, and I was introduced to this term that freaking movie with Cameron Diaz, uh, The Holiday. I know everybody hated it. I didn't hate it. I mean, I didn't love it, but I didn't hate it. But that was like one of my favorite, like the things that I took away from that movie was like the meet cute. And so now, you know, you watch these romantic movies and you're like, oh, meet cute. I see it. I see what happened there. Well, you'll see a lot of it in Love Struck. Like that, that great way that the heroine and the hero like meet and like, you know, jaunt off on their journey to shenanigans and happily ever after you know eventually when they get there um another question i've fielded is you know where are we on the heat scale it's gonna vary it is gonna vary um for example mine uh like love struck let's say is like a 5.5 and my brazens are like a six like it's not a ton of difference as far as heat level goes um i think it's gonna vary on the author just like anything else does I am nearly 100% sure that Tana's is at least as sexy as Marine for Hire because Marine for Hire got transferred to the Love Struck imprint. So that should tell you kind of like where we're at with it. Um, as always, you know, it varies on the author. Some authors write differently. That's kind of the glory of, you know, having variety to read. So uh, Gina Maxwell has a book coming out on this freaking line in like a couple weeks after this launch. Uh, I'm super pumped for it. I'm like ridiculously excited. Like I'm more excited to read these books than I am like about my book releasing with them. I mean, I'm pumped. I'm pumped. I'm like, yay, read it. Hope you like it. Good stuff. Um, I'm just pumped. I'm like, I want to read these books. I want to read. I, that's my thing. Like I love like the, you know, romantic movies and the romantic comedies and to, you know, get that in an imprint itself with the tropes that I adore. Like my book's a matchmaker book. Yeah. Matchmaker. And it's, I had so much fun writing it. Like that is, I mean, I, I love my brazens. Love them with the love of a thousand fiery suns. And I will continue to write brazens because they're sexy. And I like the sex books. Um, but Love Struck was just like this breath of just like fresh air and like shenanigans. Like it's the my favorite part of my some of my brazens like the shenanigans like that that scene in wrong bed right guy where gabe is she's having an allergic reaction and he's like we're just gonna get some chicken noodle soup and some you know like he's totally out of his element and has no idea what the hell's going on and he's just trying so hard it's one of my favorite scenes i've written to date but i got bunches of scenes of similar flavor i guess in um me that book that i wrote that i can't even say the title to meeting his match I mean, you have a matchmaker who's like, I am going to find you a wife. And this dude's like, I don't, I don't want a wife. I don't know why you're here. Like, I don't care that my sister-in-law is like sending you down here. Like, shoo. She's like, no, no, you need this. You need a wife because you're so miserable. Cause I know, cause I'm miserable and I'm going to make you more approachable and like a better person. And so that, you know, these women I'm flying down here will kind of like dig you and you'll dig them. And then you'll be soulmates and happily ever after. And he's like, go away. Like, I don't want this. And she's like, yes, you do. You just don't know you do yet. Yeah, that's Addison and Kane, and you should check them out because that clash is some good times. So yes, the 21st Monday, 
the books will be on sale for 99 cents only for the first week. So if you're like, mm, I might check this series, you know, this, this is in print out, that's the time to buy. Um, I hope you like it. And there's linkies down in the, not in my pants, in, in the little box below this video. So yeah. Um, I probably won't be here next week because I'm going to be in San Antonio melting my face off in that heat, but I will come back with stories. Mm -hmm. So toodles, have a great rest of your weekend and I hope you pick our books up. Yay!